New Hunter Hunter chapters are awesome sauce. We got to see the backstory of the Fook and Phantom Troop. We got properly acquainted with the new main character Heinrich, and all this culture forgot some melody stuff at the end. Wow! We also got a bunch of Morena goons introduced, and today I want to talk about one of them, Yokodani the lawyer. There are two things I want to talk about with him: his cool ability and Jabba! The story was sufficient in introducing some facts with his scene in chapter 399. By having Nobunaga face Yokotani and use this weird chain sword attack, maybe could have inspired him, Yokotani gets to talk about how in his country samurai don't do this. This tells us that 1. Yokotani is from Hunter x Hunter Japan, just like Hanzo and Basho, which furthers the diverse international character of Morena's group. 2. Nobunaga might not have any connection to Hunter x Hunter Japan, so he didn't get any training there or whatever. Which makes sense, seeing as he is from Meteor City and likely was inspired by Peter Samurai movies, similar to his movie-inspired Spider Brethren, and free. Some insight for his ability. Yokotani would use the Japanese law system for his ability, and not a Kaken or Hunter x Hunter specific law system that us the readers wouldn't know everything about. So if you know about the Japanese law system, you'll be able to fully understand the ability. And otherwise you'll at least know it is based on reality. Ability. His ability is super dope since it is hyper specific, which makes it extremely powerful in the extremely niche situation it can be used. First, it only works when he is in the Haile hideout and Morena the leader has to be present. Second, Yokotani needs to formally introduce himself to whoever he is targeting, and the target must be breaking a law for the ability to even activate. This means the ability has a very limited use, which increases its power. There is a risk factor here too, since a law needs to be broken for the ability to activate, there is an inherent sense of danger here. Even attempted murder didn't allow him to use the ability at max capacity, and an attempted murder most likely will cause him damage. Third, the ability is tied to Yokotani's knowledge of law. Seeing as he is a lawyer, he must have some kind of affinity to the subject, which makes the ability more powerful. But getting a broken law wrong might give him a handicap, like temporarily removing his nan, which would balance out the ability. A level 5 version of the ability was able to drag Nobunaga away, but it didn't really do anything else, and that's at the highest level of the ability. The only reason the ability was so effective is because of someone else's teleporting ability that sent Hinrich and Nobunaga away. So if you're working on your own, it isn't really that good of an ability either way. This chapter does show that making a super specific ability can be useful in the right situation. But outside of the hideout, Yokotani is not going to be that useful to the team, or for himself. He can't really fend for himself. This dude only appeared in a single chapter, together with some other Morena goons, but just having this quick bit of characterization for them means their potential future defeat or victory will be more engaging. Just thought it was pretty cool. Let's all patiently wait until the next chapter drops. Bye bye.